Hey everybody, this is a quick video in case you have a Sony NSZ GS7 media player and you need to reset the remote commander on it. Um, you might want to do this for one of two reasons. The first reason would be uh, troubleshooting. If you're having any issues with this remote commander, not responding, not connecting, not pairing, um, not, you know, not working in any kind of ways like that, a hard reset can fix a lot of things. Another thing is if you're trying to set this up as a brand new device, um, it can just be a good a good thing to do to just uh, go ahead and do a hard reset, restore all the factory settings on it, and it's quite easy to do. So all we want to do if we want to do the hard reset is we're going to find the function button here. We're going to find the back button here and the mode button over here. And we're going to press and hold those three buttons simultaneously for several seconds. And you'll know you're done when the light on the side, the little indicator light, will blink twice slowly. Um, and then once you've done that, then you can just turn the remote commander off. And then when you turn it back on, you can set it up as a new device.